What's up guys, it's Jeffrey back with another video and in today's video we're going to be talking about the importance of risk management when trading Forex and real quick if you're new to the channel guys make sure to hit that subscribe button that way you can stay up to date with the videos I post and let's go ahead and get right into it guys. Risk management is absolutely the key fundamental most important thing that you could possibly do in trading ever. Like. I can't stress the importance of risk management to you guys. Like it is the most important thing in your trading. Every single profitable trader, successful business owner, they all control risk management. Guys, most new traders get into this and then they immediately are over leveraging their account. They're putting on way too many positions, multiple orders, multiple pairs with $100. It's impossible, you cannot do that. You gotta take a step back and you actually have to calculate your risk, focus on what you're risking per trade, have a plan, have a strategy, stop going in there just gambling all the time. You're not gonna make any money if you're just gambling, okay? You, you really are not gonna do yourself any good if you're trying to trade all the time and you have no idea what you're doing and you're not using a strategy. You can't just be going out there into the markets every single day not implementing a, a strategy that you've tested and you have confidence in on what you're actually looking at so that's it's key guys make sure that you're using proper risk management so every single person that hasn't used risk manage risk management properly has blown their account before Every new trader does it. I've done it. Every single person who has started trading, unless they're just some type of trading wizard, um, they've blown an account. And it's okay to blow an account, guys, but you have to take it as a lesson. You have to learn from this. You know, whenever you blow an account, you can't immediately go in there, revenge trading, trying to make all your money back the same day or the same week. It's going to take time to build it back up. It's going to take time to get it back to where it was. You over leveraged your account. You did it to yourself. You have to control risk, guys. Risk maximum, maximum 3% per trade. 3% per trade. If you're taking two trades, then risk 1.5% on one, 1.5% on the other. Don't risk more than 3%, guys. Anytime you risk more than 3%, you can risk 5%, you can risk 10%, go for it. Do it after a year of trading or so. Trust your strategy, trust your analysis, trust what you're looking at. Don't just go in there blindly risking five, 10%, and you're just gonna blow your account. What's the point, guys? You're just giving money to the market. Do that on a demo account. Don't do it with real money. It doesn't make any sense. Like, I'm, I'm making this video to get it clear to you, get it through your head. Stop over leveraging your account. Use proper risk management, 3% per trade, max 5%. Do 3%, 2% per risk, uh, per trade for at least six months. Give it time, practice, develop on a demo account. You have to, you have to give this time, guys. It's not something that's just going to come overnight. So, um, let's see. Yeah, and if you get to a point to where you feel confident in your trading setup, then you can actually start you know, using 5%, 10% on your trades. But you need to start off from the ground level, start with 2%, start with 3%, you know, get to where you're actually understanding what you're looking at in the markets, what you're looking for, the pattern, the setup, the time that it occurs, uh, things that have happened to get to that point in your analysis, all of that, it has to come in sync with one another before you take your trade. So just keep all this in mind, guys. Use proper risk management. This is just a little quick video I wanted to make for you. And, you know, it. I just, so many people are sending me setups of, you know, multiple orders on multiple positions, stick to one pair, use 3%. Like, just be practical, guys. You can't take $100 to 100,000 in a week. It's not practical. It's just, it's not even possible to think like that. Like you can't do that from the beginning, 
okay guys you have to learn and you have to trust the process give it time it's something that's just gonna come by you actually looking and studying the markets every single day you have to study every single day guys so that's all i have for this video guys i hope you enjoyed it if you did please leave a thumbs up on this video and again if you're not subscribed hit that subscribe button and i will see you guys in the next video